Our story begins on May 16, 1977, a day that marked the end of an era in Mali. Dibo Keita, the visionary leader, philosopher, and the country's first president, passed away. But who was Modibo Keita? And what legacy did he leave behind? Let's find out. Hello fellow explorers, and welcome back to African Dive. Today we are delving deep into the life and legacy of a remarkable individual who made an indelible mark on the African continent. We are starting our journey on the day he passed away, but we will soon unravel the incredible story of Modibo Keita. So, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to join us on this captivating journey through history. Modibo Keita was born in 1915 in the heart of French West Africa, Mali, during the colonial era. Despite the odds, he excelled academically and eventually made his way to France for further studies. After completing his education, he returned to Mali, where he would begin his journey into politics. Modibo Keita's rise to power was nothing short of extraordinary. He founded the Sudanese Union, which later merged with other groups to form the USRDA party. In 1960, Mali gained its independence from France, and Modibo Keita became the nation's first president. As President Keita had a vision for Mali and the entire of African continent, he implemented a radical program of socialism and self-sufficiency, known as African Socialism. His administration undertook massive infrastructure projects, invested in education, and promoted use of indigenous languages. Under Keita's leadership, Mali became a symbol of African independence and self-reliance. He also played a pivotal role in the formation of Organization of African Unity, OAU, now the African Union, a milestone in African diplomacy. However, Modibo Keita rule was not without its challenges. Economic hardship, political repression, and growing dissatisfaction among the population led to a decline in his popularity. By 1968, his government faced a coup, leading to his removal from power. Keita's fall from grace was a tragic chapter in Mali's history. He was imprisoned until his death in 1977, leaving behind a complicated legacy. Despite the turbulent end to his political career, Modibo Keita's legacy lives on. He was a champion of African unity, self-reliance, and cultural identity. His ideals and vision continue to inspire generations of Africans. Modibo Keita's contribution to Pan-African movement and his commitment to building self-sufficient Mali remain the central to the nation's identity. As we wrap our journey through the life and legacy of Modibo Keita, we are reminded of the complex and impactful nature of his story. His vision for Mali and Africa lives on, shaping the course of the continent through history. Thank you for joining us on African Dive. If you enjoyed this exploration of African history, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and share it with your fellow history enthusiasts. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to join us on our future endeavors. Until next time, keep diving into the treasures of African past. This is African Dive. Join me on the journey to one Africa.